The damage here along the Gulf Coast is catastrophic. There's a frantic effort underway tonight to find survivors. There are an uncounted number of the dead tonight. In the summer of 2005, a Category 3 storm broke through the levees of New Orleans, drowning the city in up to 15 feet of water. Hurricane Katrina left death and devastation in its wake. When the waters subsided, almost an entire city was homeless. People lost not only their physical possessions, many also lost their jobs, their businesses and their communities. Faced with destruction at every turn and stripped of the routine of everyday life, Many people experienced post-traumatic stress, depression, and a deep sense of disorientation. The houses that remained were badly damaged and few had functioning kitchens. The Chabad Jewish Center in Mattery was stripped to the walls due to water damage, but its commercial kitchen remained intact. Here, every Friday, women from the community cooked fish, soup, challah, and chicken. On Friday night and Saturday, more than 70 people gathered in the social hall. The comfort of warm food, the sound of song, and the deep bonds of friendship replaced the harsh challenge of rebuilding broken lives. The atmosphere of camaraderie was healing as people shared their experiences and learned to laugh again. Rebetzin Hani Nemes commented, we became like a huge family for a year and a half, these gatherings provided a haven that gave people the emotional strength to carry on and rebuild. We may not have had houses to live in, but every week we created a home. Join us this week as we explore the power of a home, a place of caring and bonding from which you, your family, and your community can build resilience to face the challenges of the outside world.